Hey guys, Santa here. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to uh, Sunday Night Mixed Media Backgrounds. So I am using a pre-printed paper uh, for my background sheet. This is from, I just cut off this branding sip, uh, Photo Prolite, can't even speak, Photo Play, uh, Summer Vibes. I am using this stencil right here, which is the September 2023 stencil of the month. Uh, so these stencils all were shipped out this weekend uh, to everyone who is a part of the Stencil of the Month Club. I am going to um, do some of this inked uh, or off the edges, and then I think I'm going to put this in the center and glitter glaze it. So let's see what I can do. Well guys, apparently I never pressed record when I started to do the background. So, as you can see, I had my piece of paper that had uh, circles already on it. These circles did overlap and the colors changed. I'm still wet from washing off my stencil. What I did was I took the stencil and I held it off over here. I used my peach ink pad from close to my heart along with a blender brush and just inked on three places. So I put it here, I put it here, I put it here. I made sure none of these little pointy things of the mandala touched each other and that they were nestled in between. So like there's a pointy thing here, there's a pointy thing here, a round thing, a round thing. None of them are touching but they're nestled. So I did that on all three sections. And then I took my stencil and placed it directly over top of the 12 by 12 piece of paper and I put glitter glaze through it. Now, the glitter glaze I used was Fallen Snow. This one is almost empty. I thought I was gonna finish this one off for this background, but that did not happen. Um, so anyway, the background is there for that. So this is my mixed media background. The glitter glaze is kind of thick. I don't know if you can see. I don't know if the camera's gonna pick up a good angle for it. Um, it is kind of thick, so it is going to take a hot minute to dry. So Monday, I will scrapbook with this background, and it will be fabulous, right? Like, it'll be fabulous. At least I think it'll be fabulous, because I think this is pretty fabulous as it is. I almost wish I would have done this, the three stencils, and then glitter glaze each side. But honestly, the thing about a Sunday night mixed media background is I should be able to get the background done, let it dry, and use it the next day. If I was doing that, I would have to, I would have to ink and then glitter glaze over the top, let that dry, or ink all of them at least, glitter glaze one of them, let that dry, and then glitter glaze the second one, let that dry, and glitter glaze the third, and let that dry, because the stencil would be covering up, like the stencil would be touching the wet glitter glaze, and nobody needs that in their lives. Anyway, that is gonna do it for this video, you guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys again real soon for another video.